This is a football. Today, I'm going to try my best to turn this football into a pair of shoes. I don't know why, but I feel like this is going to be cool. I saw somebody turn a football into a wallet, and I thought it was a perfect opportunity to turn a football into a shoe. If it works, it's going to be awesome. But I think we just got to jump right into it. This is what's inside of football, if you're wondering. We're gonna set that aside. I'm probably honestly gonna use that too. I'm gonna use everything from this. All this stitching, the writing, white, brown. I think it'll all look cool on a shoe. But first step, I'm gonna take apart this football. I actually got this idea from someone who DM'd me and sent me a video. They literally told me the idea. So if you have more ideas, DM me so I can take credit for them and make dope videos. This is inside of football. Cool, it kinda has a cool like design. I could use that on the shoe too. I got four of these from the football, but there's like a weird warp. See that? It's like a weird, it's not flat. So to make it flat. Oh, okay. I got this heat press. I'm going to press on these and flatten them out. Oh, that worked so good. What? Now it's flat. <laughs> I'm also gonna take the sole off of this Air Force One that I have, this sole. So when I make the shoe, I have a sole to put it on. All right, now I have this piece of the Air Force One. I'm gonna use my football fabric and wrap it around this material and kind of remake the Air Force One out of this material. I have this rubber cement. I'm gonna cover this whole piece with the glue. Now it's stuck together. Also, I don't want the white leather to show, so I'm gonna wrap it around over the top of it. So that's all you're gonna see on the shoe. I want it to look like it's 100% made out of just footballs, nothing else. All right, now it's all glued on, but on the side, okay, look, this is a normal Air Force One. I wanna cut this out like jagged, kinda like flames or something, like this. Now I'm gonna fold this over like that, so the edge is nice and clean like that. The football's not long enough, so I had to do multiple pieces, but now for the toe box. Instead of using this side of the fabric, so it has some like contrast, I'm gonna use this side. They look good together. Stay there. I'm gonna repoke all these holes with this hole puncher. That's perfect size for me. Now, I know what you're thinking. It looks like, what's the word? Um, Poop. Yes. Okay, now I got my sewing machine. I'm gonna sew this, all this line back together and it's gonna look beautiful. Check this out. This is the inside of a football. This is the outside. I'm gonna go on the shoe like this. This is sick, oh my gosh. If this turns out cool, I can also do basketballs and soccer balls, all that other stuff. Now for this piece, I'm already halfway through my mats. So I'm gonna unlace the football so I can use these laces later on. You see this part of the football? All these holes? What does that look like to you? Please don't think dirty, think. Look at that. It's already the exact amount of holes as this part of the shoe. This is perfect. This is the next piece. I'm gonna use this side to go here. With each piece, I gotta flatten the fabric first, and then trace the same shape, cut it out, glue it on, and then once the glue's dry, then I can start sewing it together. All right, now I'm gonna do the same thing on this edge, where I like cut it and then fold it over so it looks clean. I only have to do it to this edge because these edges aren't gonna be shown. Oh, this is looking cool. Now I need to sew and follow all these little flames. Then I can do the other side. This is gonna be hard because I have to follow all these little flames with the stitches. Hopefully it looks good. All right, this, this is all sewed. Now I need to sew this part. This is coming together really well. Dude, also this piece right here, that clip, I don't even know if I filmed the whole thing. It was 45 minutes. All right, now this is all sewed together. This side of the shoe looks pretty cool. I'm gonna repeat the exact same thing on the other side. Then I can start working on the top, the back, and this design. Probably like halfway done. I had to get a second ball. I ran out of the first one. But the shoe's almost done. This is how it looks. It's even on both sides. Next piece, I need to make this piece that like connects the laces together. With the new ball, I'm probably gonna use this part of it to like lace it together. I also wanna use these strings as the laces on the shoes.
So far, this is literally perfect. Look how good this looks. I'm poking all the holes for the laces right now on the shoe. I think we're gonna have this done today. This is it so far. Let's finish this up. I'm gonna start gluing this on to the sole so I can kind of start measuring out the back of it too. This looks so good. Look at this so far. Oh, I'm almost done. I gotta finish up the back. For the sock liner, the inside, this is like a piece from the football. This is like the inside of the football. So I'm gonna turn the inside of the football into the inside of the shoe. Hopefully this works. It's kind of like a rubbery, I don't even know what this is, like rubbery fabric, but I think it'll look cool if it's like the inside of the shoe. And the color matches. I'm sewing together a little back tab right here. This piece, it's gonna go right here and hold together the back of the shoe. Then I also made this thing with the NFL logo to go up here. This is gonna look cool, okay. Right, so I just used the rubber from inside the ball and I cut out a Nike swoosh out of the rubber That's gonna go right here on the side of the shoe. I think that looks cool And then the shoe will be a hundred percent from the football All right, I'm finishing up for the laces. I feel like I'm gonna be honest, I think the regular laces would actually look better. This is a little bit too thin and it looks kind of weird, but now I'm gonna lace these up and then they're done. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm done. I started out with just a football, just like this, and now check it out. Three, two, one. The football shoe is done. Check this out. Football Air Force Ones. Check these out. The football leather here, inside of the football here, the rubber from the inside. Look at all this. Official size. These are awesome. These are one of my favorite shoes I've made. Look how cool these are. I had a great time making these. Thanks for watching. I love you guys. Let me know what else you want to see me turn into a shoe. So, this was fun. Subscribe to Marco, he is so sexy and amazing.